to my youtube channel for real for real i'm actually serious this time welcome to my youtube channel i've been saying i want to open a youtube channel i want to open a youtube channel and i've just been waiting for that right time to start so i've been postponing and just waiting for everything to be right in fact i've been making videos from last year just you know preparing for the youtube channel and preparing content for you guys but this is me just starting anyhow you know when they say just start this is me just starting so this might be like the most unusual first time i welcome to my youtube channel video you'll see i owe you guys a proper introductory video maybe or maybe we'll just go with the flow today's video is actually long overdue last year i documented how i suspected my proposal and i was right i documented the process and the proposal and everything and everything yes the video is long overdue but it's still not too late to share and in fact it is so timely because today makes it a year i said yes to my us now husband then boyfriend today makes it exactly a year i said yes and he put the ring on me oh my god where's my ring <laughs> anyways i'm excited to be sharing that with you all today and i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you enjoy I, I hope you like feel the joy i felt in the video and yeah let's go hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel actually right now i don't have a youtube channel i've not opened one but i'm just making this video because i plan to open a youtube channel soon and i already have an idea of kind of thing i want to post anyways that's not just for today today is 18th of march and i feel like my boyfriend and my friend in yola they're trying to set me up for my proposal maybe it's happening tomorrow that's what i feel like i strongly feel i've been suspecting and i'll explain last year december and Yola told me about a friend that has an event coming up, a movie, something about movie. And she was inviting me and Yola to come for the event. That was in December. And I was like, okay, no problem. Whenever it is, just tell me I would like to go. So January, she didn't tell me anything. February, I'd even forgotten about it. Then February, she, and Yola texted me and said, oh, do I remember that friend's event she told me about in December? it's coming up in february and all of that i was like okay fine i was even thinking of what to wear already i was already looking for what i'll get online to wear and all of that then and yola got back to me and said that the friend postponed it though she actually sent me screenshots messages of conversations with bookie bookie's and your last friend so and yola sent me screenshots of conversations she had with bookie where bookie was telling her oh i'm sorry the event has been postponed it's not going to be in march please help me tell blessing not to be angry and i'm that that i'm still expecting that and everything and everything but i'm now thinking why i don't know it's just and especially because my boyfriend and i if you are going to if you have plans to get married to someone you'd have been speaking about it talking about it you will just know i'm very hard to surprise so if you are trying to surprise me or if you are already expecting that you will do something i already start to calculate and try to put one and two together to make sense out of it so maybe i'm just overthinking it if i'm wrong i'm not going to post this video but if i'm right i'm definitely going to post this video i just know i just strongly feel that they are up to something so by the way the event is tomorrow and she was using time to tell me to get my nails done because, and i feel like it's because there's going to be a ring on it of course my nails has to be done if there's going to be a ring on it we even got makeup artists we got the makeup artist that will come and do our makeup if it is truly the event bookies event then oh my overthinking is just a waste but anyways you guys will find out and i'll tell you we'll find out together right let's find out together <laughs> oh my god i'm coming <laughs> hi guys good morning so it's the morning of lessons proposal and yeah i'm so excited oh my god i'm so excited and so the plan i quick story i told blessing that a friend of mine invited me for a movie premiere blah 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 i didn't know how i pulled that through but I hope it works. I don't know. I feel like she's suspecting already. But either ways, I know um, I've tried my best. <laughs> yeah. So she's coming over to my place today. 
for the movie premiere <laughs> so she's coming over to my place after a gym class and then we head out don't worry i'm going to keep you guys updated it's <laughs> okay. so guys i'm in a new last place now yes uh -uh, i love That's your hair Please don't light because I need to iron my dress. Or oh, whatever, we have been up. So. so you guys, this whole thing is becoming very confusing for me because today my boyfriend said he was going to his mom's place and he's going to spend the night there. So he's not going to leave his mom's place till tomorrow. That's what he told me. And I kind of believed because I don't know, I just believed, but I'm confused. Um I'm in your last place now, but she's cooking for me. And then she told me that the makeup artist is coming by 6 p.m. That the event is for 10 p.m. Okay, fine. The event is for 10 p.m. Makeup artist is going to come by 6 p.m. And then she was like, a friend, Bookie, got like a service department, Airbnb, yes, where we are going to first go to before we now go to the, to the event center. As well it's confusing but so far she's not giving me the vibes of someone that is hiding something from me like everything still seems normal so i don't even know i don't know that was supposed to drop our things before we go to the venue for the movie so that's what's happening now
For those of you on the video that is not... But you used to reply to my status now. Yes, no. I'm and you said that she wants to judge Ellie. I know. She did not come to judge you. Such a cutie. No, where are you? Where is our mom? Is that true? She's not sure. How would I get away? Sister Ellie. My love. Sister Ellie. Both of you. You have Dami Larry, you have Dalako, you have Dami, and a lot of followers. Julian, Taiwo, and Ken. Oh, oh. Say hello.
Hey, are you ready? Uh -uh. <laughs> Is it how I feel. I have a lot of messages to reply to at this moment. My Instagram DM is full of messages. Besides the overwhelming feeling of oh, how am I supposed to react? I don't know how I feel. I know that deep down I feel very happy. I just feel like I need some time to you know, soak it all in, process the thoughts, accept where I am right now, and really just Taking the moment, taking the re the new reality. <laughs> yes, yeah, so but above all, I'm very excited. I'm very grateful. I'm very thankful. I feel good. I just I'm okay. I'm fine. <laughs> so you see, all the while my sus my prediction was right. Like I wasn't even sure hundred percent. It was a maybe or maybe not. It was so confusing. But yeah, I'm glad I'm here now <laughs> and I'm excited. Thank you for watching. If you've watched to this point, thank you for watching. I'm really deliberate about documenting this moment and every other beautiful moment, uh, moment. <laughs> every other beautiful moment to come. And lately, well, since the beginning of this year, I also started to take journaling more seriously. So I like to write down my thoughts, my emotions, and just I've taken up this habit of just speaking to the camera to express how I feel because moments just come and go. It's like they move so fast. Moments come and go. Same thing with our emotions. They it's like really fast. What you feel right now might not be what you're feeling like in the next minute. So I don't forget my thoughts, I don't forget my emotions. That's why I'm so deliberate about you know just documenting everything so that later on i can always watch and remember that oh this is how i felt because most moments happens just once once in a lifetime and you might not be able to go back to it or exactly remember how you felt later on i pray that we would all get to experience beautiful things in life in jesus name I pray that we all get to experience sweet things lovely things beautiful things and everything that is of good report amen if you're watching my video for the first time please subscribe and if you're a returning subscriber please share this video like and leave a comment below 
Thank you so much. I love you.